check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. What's up everybody, Coach Quan here, back with another video. Today we're gonna be working our mobility again, where we've got our back today, right? We're gonna be going mid back and low back, just getting that full back going today, guys. I hope you guys are excited. But before we get there, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Guys, you've been growing. We hit 42K subs this week. Truly appreciate and love you guys. You guys have been loving these recovery videos. So I'm gonna keep giving you guys those basics of training different body parts. So comment your favorite body part down below that you wanna see me train so I can help you guys get better. And also we're gonna be doing a lot of recovery. So if you have any part of your body that hurts your knees, your back, your shoulders, whatever, let me know down below. And if I haven't made a video on it already, I'll make a video for you guys, all right? So I really appreciate you guys. Don't forget to get you some Transparent Lab supplements down below so we can keep making these gains. And also, if you need a little bit more advice from me outside of these videos, go ahead and get you an online training program and I got you guys as well. But without further ado, let's get to this workout. Let's get loose. It's gonna be short. Like I said, these are videos are gonna be under six minutes. So let's go ahead, let's have some fun and let's go. Yeah. All right, folks, so normally with your back, it just comes from you not being mobile enough and not practicing mobility is why we have a lot of pain. Things get out of line and you have to go to like a chiropractor or go see a medical professional. So I'm gonna give you guys a couple of exercises today that you can use to mobilize your spine and get things back in alignment and overall strengthen and you know, work on mobility. So we're gonna start with our upper back here. We're gonna get in that kneeling position, put our elbows on the ground, and we're gonna slowly rotate out and up. I want two to three sets on each side, eight to 10 reps working on rotating as we come up. You're gonna feel it in your upper back. It's gonna be really tight. Remember, give me eight to 10 reps here. I'll slow it down for you one more time. I want you to come up, drive that elbow up, open out and up, looking up at the sky, okay? Again, eight to 10 reps on each side with these. It's really simple, but it's super effective. And another thing I like to do as I'm working on, working on my upper back is this is something I also do for my shoulders. I like to reach across, grab something like a wall, and turn my head and body away while I'm rotating my shoulder in, I feel stretching here. So as we're slowly moving down, I like to hit these, try to find a wall, something that's a little bit more balanced. I grab along here, turn and rotate, okay? Kind of fighting that resistance a bit and opening up. So with those, I like to hold for about 15 to 20 seconds at a time. Again, two to three sets on each side, probably like four or five reps each set as we're alternating side spinning about 20 seconds. All right, now we're gonna take it to working on our lower back. So one of my favorite lower back stretches is I like to reach my hands out in front right here and I stick my butt back and up and I dig my hands into the ground, okay? Dig them down and you're trying to drag across the ground like you're being pulled from behind and you open up that lower back. You're gonna feel it in the mid to lower, just nice and controlled here. Good, another 15 to 20 seconds, five reps, 10 reps if you have some time and just take your time there, nice and controlled. Then I like to rotate, I'm gonna go to the side so you can see, take it down, put my pelvis on the ground, and then come all the way up nice and controlled here. Again, not jerky, not fast, just slow and controlled. Another 20 seconds here, getting that chest up, feeling that back stretch out. And now we're gonna do some work for the lower back. And we're, with this, we're gonna start with a little bit of hip work, so you'll see. Let's take it down, finish this thing strong. I hope these exercises are helping. If they are, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share this with a friend, and we're gonna get mobile together. The reason why I'm doing these videos is because I myself have been super tight and had a lot of injuries recently, so I want to find ways to get looser, and as I'm learning more, I'm gonna share it with you. So, let's keep growing. All right, folks, now we're lying down on our backs here. Hope you can see my legs. I know I'm wearing black, but I get my leg out in front of me, flat, we're gonna get one leg up and let it drift to the side, feeling your lower back stretch. Don't force it down, just let your back loosen up by driving that knee to the side. And again, another 15, 20 seconds here, holding. If you're, as your hip starts to rotate, you're gonna feel tightness in your glute and in your low back. So just sit there, let it stretch, bring your back down to relax, come back across, just like that. Again, feeling that stretch in your glute and your low back. Sometimes when your glute's too tight, it pulls on your back and vice versa. So you wanna make sure those are both loose. I also sometimes like to put the bottom of my feet together, open up my hips and lift my low back off the ground and push it back down. I do about 10 reps of these, lifting my chest up, my stomach up and pushing it back down. Again, just working on mobility as well as I'm stretching. These are some great exercises to help with back injuries or to prevent them. And if you are already injured, make sure you consult a physician before you start doing any of these stretches. We don't want to keep you safe. I'm not a physician, I'm a trainer. So I'm just trying to help you guys out, okay? 
So, try some of those movements out. Let me know what you think. Again, just a couple quick movements here to fix your back pain, trying to keep you in alignment. Or if you wanna see a solo standalone video with 10 exercises or more for just low back, let me know. Same with any other body part. These are some short videos just to get you guys going. But if you guys want longer videos, I will start doing those for you. I really appreciate you guys joining me, man. Thank you so much. Don't forget to link the links down below to get some online training or some Transparent Lab supplements. Use that code Quan for 10% off. So other than that, guys, I'll see you guys soon. We got a lot of videos coming up. Again, comment down below what you guys want to see trained or help with, and I'll get you guys right, all right? Let's get to it, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks, folks.